My girlfriend is mad at me after I told her I don't want her talking simply to other guys. And this is OKOP, where we read the craziest true stories on earth. I'm John. This is Sam and Sophia. And we have a special guest in the building. Special guest. Can you introduce yes. yourself? Howdy, everybody. My name is Miles Bonsignore, and I host a call and advice show called Perfect Person. And I'm very happy to be here on OCOP. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. I know. Wow, you, the only show for all the cops. <laughs> You've committed the cardinal yeah, sin. Yeah. <laughs> Mispronouncing our name. Absolutely. Oh my God. No, it's a pleasure for me here. Yes. Uh, it's a pleasure for be here. It is a pleasure for be here. That's what yeah. we always say. Uh, we, uh, we always say it's a pleasure yeah, for be here. You're on OCOP. Yeah, yeah. You're on OCOP. <laughs> Guys, check out his podcast. Links in the description. And we're going to talk about it more. But let's get into this story from Shape Herder, who says... Uh, <laughs> gotta love it. My girlfriend, female 20, is upset when I, male 20, told her I don't want her talking to other guys. What do I do here? Seems like a reasonable request. You know, it's a real rock and a hard place <laughs> over here. I guess you say, Miles? Actually, to me, how do you define that? Exactly. You know what I mean? People are just sexually charged all the time. Some people are flirting. Mm. Uh, Some people be flirting. I feel like I'm flirty to the guy at the auto zone. I feel like I'm flirty to almost everybody. And so yes. you get 15% well, the auto off. Zone is exactly. everywhere you go. Oh, oh, get get yeah. Yeah. She's like, babe, how am I going to get my discounts? Exactly. Yeah. We might never know. Yeah. <laughs> Opie goes on to say, we're both in college and have only been dating for two weeks. Oh, oh. Oh, come on. Okay, buddy. Hey, we're walking yeah. it down. <laughs> um, her friend group is composed of two female suite mates, I guess like people that live in the dorm, and this other guy guy on their floor. Let's call him Miles. Ooh. Just kidding. His name is Alex. Uh, just, kidding, like, just, just for kicks and giggles. Uh, he <laughs> doesn't have any other friends, so they invited him to live with them next uh. year, too. Let me preface and say that I like this other guy and don't in any way worry about him. Okay, <laughs> defensive. <Yeah. laughs> I'm not worried about this guy. <laughs> kind of sounds like it, buddy. The other night, us three are at the dining hall, and my girlfriend made a she will comment to him jokingly. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and I didn't worry about it at all. <laughs> didn't think about it one bit. I was so not worried. <laughs> it was something along the lines of maybe you'll find out tonight, which I could also <laughs> read as maybe you'll find out tonight. Yeah, you know, yeah, I mean, like, yeah, it's the, yeah emphasis. Completely, like what happens in the like, end of the movie? Scores, <laughs> yeah, maybe yeah, like, yeah, right? yeah. That's pretty reasonable, but maybe not. I forget what the lead up was, but she said it with a very tone and even did the whole I bat F me eyes look. Miles, I swear this isn't how it usually it's goes okay. in this podcast. Yeah. It's, oh worse. God. it's worse. It's worse. It's usually way worse. <laughs> now she has friendzoed the dude into oblivion, but still acts flirty with him, which never really bothered me enough to confront her about it. Oh, in the past she's friend zoned him, but and now it, But now it's, it's just, so, yeah. so, she's so, into her, but yeah. she's maybe not into him. Exactly. But now it's just getting completely yeah. out of hand. And of yeah. course she's in a committed two week relationship. Oh yeah. yeah. For sure. Yeah. That will last. Yeah. 14, you know how many hours are in 14 days? Many. Many. <laughs> okay. But when she said this, I shot her a nice 10 second stare to the tune to the tune of and God, are you his, eyes, his eyes. <laughs> 10 second stare. Uh, Damn, this like guy sucks. Uh, yeah. Dude, this guy is great. This is a yeah. I feel like this is a classic, like insecure first dating, like college dude yeah. vibe yeah. Yes, going very on much. This yeah. is very nineteen to twenty years old. <laughs> yeah, they met at orientation, love yeah. at first sight. Yeah. <laughs> this is two weeks later. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, babe, I fell in love with you at first sight. <laughs> Held you, <laughs> Held you reciprocate. <laughs> we went our separate ways, and I was pissed the rest of the night. Not breaking up, I think, just no, like just, for yeah. the day. No. Um, dry and distant over text. The following morning. <laughs> Dry <laughs> text. She was asleep. <laughs> she was asleep by the way, at night. <laughs> so dry. Oh my god. Quit sleeping on me, babe. Um, the following morning, I'm done with being aloof and cold. I'm over it. I was asleep then, but now I'm activated. <laughs> oh my god. So now I text her and ask her to hash this out, to which she agrees. <laughs> I'll meet you at the dining hall. Yeah. 8 Don't a.m. sharp. <laughs> Swipe me in. <laughs> Breakfast ends at 10. Yeah. <laughs> Don't be one second late. 
I met her in person and tell her she probably knows what's bothering me. <laughs> <laughs> like she's a mind reader. <laughs> they are connected. I mean, it's been two weeks. Right? They yeah. spent 10 seconds looking into each other's eyes. <laughs> a sharp 10 second glare. <laughs> and she says to me, she doesn't. I tell her that I don't like the way that she spoke to Alex and she shot me a look like I was out of my mind. 10 seconds batting her eyes. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god she started to deflect and bring up other things like the other things that she was upset at me for many of them were trivial like <laughs> <laughs> yeah i'm sure buddy <laughs> like she was grabbing at anything and told me telling her how to talk to friends was such a deal breaker and goes against her values in a relationship and insinuated breaking up with me <laughs> she was like i want to break up yeah insinuation breaking up with you what are you insinuating <laughs> <laughs> could we cut the crap <laughs> <straight to> the <laughs> wait time? i need to look into your eyes <laughs> i don't fully understand oh my god yeah i didn't get a 10 second stare to communicate that's how we really break it down <laughs> my god frankly this scared the hell out of me <laughs> i've had girlfriends in the past but right. <laughs> sure, yeah, sure. but i have never been into any of them like i have been with her and in that moment as i felt my heart beat faster than it ever has i let her control me what and, what? What? <laughs> and ultimately i was the one who ended up apologizing <laughs> Okay, I think we need to take. We need to break this down. Yeah. We need to break this down. Is there, is there more? Oh, there's more. Oh. Oh, we, just, we just need to take a second. We just need, a we need, just need, need to debrief yeah. real quick. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's been two weeks. It's, it's been, been two, two weeks. weeks. It would be crazy to make any big decisions after only two weeks. Yeah. yeah. Also, it doesn't sound like anyone was being sexual. <laughs> <laughs> he was like, sure sexual gaze or whatever yeah. like you'll see tonight like that's nothing yeah. more games he's yeah. like oh, god <laughs> it went from uh hey go ace that test to hey go ace, ace that test, test. Uh -uh. <laughs> so okay miles let, let me ask you this yeah. um if uh you could sit down with op one-on-one -on -one at this point yeah what would your advice be on how to move forward you need to go on a long ass walk <laughs> yeah. for a couple months and maybe not no. be around people for a while. Uh, quit and, school yeah maybe quit school i feel like he this is like first relationship yeah. vibe for this yeah. person right no he's been in other relationships oh, yeah. sure. <laughs> They went to a different school, though. <laughs> yeah, those were all one they week. They were all so this real is, girls. Yeah. yeah, for real. <laughs> No, yeah, it sounds like he just is like, he's classically insecure. But the whole thing yeah. is that if you're worried that your partner is not into you, then they may not be, or you may just not need to be in that relationship. Yeah. But he's not worried, though. He's yeah. not worried. He's really, not worried. really not worried. Yeah. yeah, for sure. It's crazy that like he can write this whole story yeah. and still come off so insecure. Like this yeah. is from his perspective and he's <laughs> had time to think about it. Mm -hmm. And it's still like, you can like eat the insecurity off of this plate. It's oh, yeah, yeah it, it, it's bad. And if she didn't want to bang the guy in her hall before, she definitely <laughs> does. Yeah. True. You're driving him straight into yeah. it. crazy chemistry with this guy in yeah. your hall. And it's yeah. like, okay, like, cool. I guess I do. Our chemistry is zero, but y'all just, uh, you, have you seen the way you look at him and he looks at you? She's I like, only saw him as a friend before, but. But yeah. now. It's really it's changed my mind. <laughs> well, let's find out. So, OP, so it wasn't several months but mm. after an hour of reflection mm. okay. oh, wow. okay. <laughs> short hour walk <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. this guy's so powerful he's able to take it all in in a single hour <laughs> exactly. like, that's, what I'm, of that's what he's saying i realized that she completely took my power away from me <laughs> he felt emasculated yeah it's like vegeta <laughs> what's he talking about i can no longer go super <laughs> saiyan because of her evil ways <laughs> she's depleted me of my energy <laughs> oh my god um, and I shot her a text outlining the fact that a personal, very general boundary of mine is that my girlfriend doesn't make sexual comments to another straight guy in front of me. So gay guys, we're all in. Hey, listen up. Now floor the gas, but straight guys, you better watch out, okay? Oh my God. Um, and I can't be in a relationship with her either if she can't agree to such a small thing. I compromised by telling her she can say whatever she wants to him when I'm not there. Interesting. So 
Wait, 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 hang on. So she can say anything she wants to anybody if he's not in the room. Yeah, exactly. I feel like that's the opposite of the way. I want to hook up with you. He didn't hear it. Yeah. Yeah. We're good to go. Yeah, he yeah. wasn't there. The wow. second he walks in, he hands everyone scripts. Yeah. <laughs> this is exactly. what we're doing. Uh, at the top, in all bold, no yeah. eye contact yeah. whatsoever. He says, lights up. Yeah. 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 Oh, my God. Um, but... I just really don't want to be there to hear it. Again, I'm not a jealous person, <laughs> and I'm confident in my own shoes. Ooh. No, <laughs> oh, <sir. laughs> And Alex is not the kind of guy to worry about, but it's just a personal rule of mine that I feel most people can get behind. But not her. She refused to see reason and asserted again that me telling her how she talks to her friends is a huge deal breaker, quote unquote, goes against her values. I tried to tell her that it's not me telling her how to talk to her friends. <laughs> hmm. it's, it's my values. It's, it's my values. values. <laughs> <laughs> Which would be very unfair of me after only knowing her. <laughs> if I were to say that, that would be great. This, be moment great. Is so awareness. <laughs> <laughs> this thing I just said to you is insane, but. I did, but did not say that. <laughs> yeah. It's very simple, very clear cut here, which would be very unfair uh, of me after only knowing her for a month versus the amount of time that she has known them. I simply don't want to hear her saying suggestive things to another straight guy in front of me, regardless of context. Oh, <laughs> I'm so lost. This I is sort of like the classic case of if your partner wants to bang somebody else, they are going to do it regardless of what you say. <laughs> Yeah. So you playing into their hand by being like, you definitely shouldn't say a sexual joke to yeah. this guy. Like, obviously, this is just going to make her more annoyed mm -hmm. with the current boyfriend. And that, maybe he's okay with the banging if it's not in front of him. Yeah. <laughs> me, or, if, we're really, if we're lawyering this, then technically speaking, it's not in front of him. If you put yeah. a do not disturb sign, he's yeah. like, okay, got no, it. No one's seeing it yeah. but them. Oh. So that's like so did it really double happen? points. Yeah. yeah. Oh my God. Also, I feel like he's like creating an algorithm to decipher. Like you need an algorithm to decipher if you're following his rules or not. At this yeah. point, yeah. I'm yeah. absolutely <laughs> completely it's lost. rules. <laughs> True. <laughs> Um, we have something to show you later. Oh, actually, um, oh, we right. do. <laughs> Riley, you know what I'm talking about. Oh, no. Um, she does not see where I'm coming from in any way, shape or form. We haven't talked in damn near 36 hours. <laughs> a full quarter of our relationship. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Uh, you know, but it's kind of cute how like there's like he feels like there's so many emotions and so little time. Like I'm I'm kind of I'm kind of into it now. <laughs> <laughs> Young love. Oh, oh God. Uh, and now we are at a stalemate. I don't see her apologizing anytime soon. And if I were to give in myself, I would lose self-respect, <laughs> which is something much bigger than me and her. <laughs> His own self-respect. <laughs> exactly. It it's so it's much bigger deeper. than all of us. Okay? I respect you more than anything could ever be. <laughs> also, I love he says his self-respect is even bigger than himself. Yeah. yeah. Like, yeah. How is that Do we know how old he is? Beyond. He's, he's like 19. 20. Okay. Okay. He's 20. He's 20. He's 20. So yeah. he's a That's sophomore classic. in college, maybe. Yeah. yeah. I think, just, yeah, sophomore, maybe junior in college. My God. Um... <laughs> And I really don't want to break up with her, but just don't see where to go from here. And that is no choice. Wow. Now, that's the conclusion. That, oh, so we need it? to give advice. That's all we got. <laughs> okay. So now we really got to go in deep. Yeah. You shouldn't okay. date anybody. It's <laughs> my <laughs> stunning advice. Okay. Yeah. I don't think that he should be dating yeah. almost anybody until he figures out his own yeah. thing. Yeah. He and, needs some time. Yeah, he needs a little bit of time. What do you think figuring out his own thing looks like? Like, is he like going to the cafeteria on a dinner date with himself? Like, uh, yeah, he needs yeah. to do self care. <laughs> yeah, self care. <laughs> I think he also just needs to understand that, like, it's like the least hot thing you could possibly do is control the person yeah. that you're trying to woo. Mm -hmm. And wow, yeah. that rhymed. Yeah, and that wasn't <laughs> even trying to have that happen. If I could say, that sounds like perfect advice. That's <laughs> correct. Right? Actually, yeah. yeah. Uh, but I just think that, you know, especially with insecurity and jealousy and stuff like that, it always is a self-fulfilling prophecy. Yeah. Like mm -hmm. if you are jealous about somebody and you're like, babe, you can't do that or you can't do this, then it's going to enlarge. Usually that is just going to make the person more frustrated because it's like controlling. Yeah. 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 hundred percent. Mm hmm. 
God, this, we need to keep this guy away from from women for a little bit. <laughs> yeah, yeah definitely. It sounds like, she, like she is soft breaking up with him at the very least. Yeah, absolutely. Right now, Imagine right. you were two weeks in a day. Someone yeah. were like, "Excuse me, <laughs> you spoke to your friend in the cafeteria <laughs> in a weird way." It's too much. Did you not see your eye batting? Yeah. It's the classic F me eyes. I know what I'm talking about. I've been in three <laughs> one week relationships. Okay. All of them ended amazingly. I just yeah. took psychology 101. Yeah. 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 <laughs> oh my God. Uh, wow. Yeah. Oh, well, shout out to this guy. Yeah. yeah um, big shout I hope out. you find love after a long period of self reflection. But one, you know yeah. what I would love, well, Sam? I was going to say, one of our friends actually told another 19 year old to wait <laughs> until they were 30. Thirty to date anyone? Yeah, so I feel he was like that's pissed. That's so funny. Wait till you're thirty. She said this seriously. Oh, thirty-five. Yeah, she said yeah. you yeah. might not. You might yeah. want to do some evolving yeah. Yeah. before you go. Yeah, that's yeah. yeah. some wealth building. Yeah, yeah. 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 you need to get more money. Yeah. 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 You need more cash yeah. before yeah. you can date anybody. Yeah. You need cash or personality. You need to at least finish your psychology course. You don't know how it ends yet. Yeah. Yeah. I failed Psych 101. <laughs> I at least got a D. I hey, did not do well. That's, that's a pass to me. That's a pass in my book. And now and I give advice on the internet. <laughs> there we go. Yeah. I feel like you've made up for it. Yeah. Oh, thank, you. Extra yeah. Credit. thank you. Yeah. 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 Thank you. Yeah. 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 Thank you. It's a I'll take the C. I'll take the C. It's a pass. It's a passing grade. Sam, you know what I want to see? This next story. Am I the a-hole for asking my best friend to break up with his uneducated, unemployed? girlfriend so we can be together Jesus there's a theme of insecurity <laughs> running yeah. through this story. Riley what parts of reddit did you go to today <laughs> <laughs> Red <Sad>. pill only. <laughs> yeah. so I know the title makes me seem like a little bitch but I can think of another <laughs> But I'm going to think of another way to summarize it in one go. We'll call him Dean and call his girlfriend, Helen. Basically, I'm a university student and interned at a marketing company over the last few summers. Dean was my boss. And there we became really close friends. Mm. Our friendship moved outside of work and I no longer interned there at all. The more we talked, the more I fell for him. He's incredible, hardworking, successful, funny, and the whole package. His girlfriend is not. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Damn. In my opinion, she's actually a loser. She's uneducated and unemployed. Helen dropped out of high school because of family problems. Apparently, her mom has severe anxiety and depression. <laughs> Holy Overdosed shit. multiple Bro. times when Helen was a kid and would have breakdowns and threaten to hurt herself if she was left alone. Apparently. 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 So Helen what? stayed home home with her like a chump. <laughs> Wow. Take care so of her, her ailing mother. This fucking idiot yeah. mothered her child. She's a freaking loser. Yeah, she's a dork. And still does when necessary because her father can't get retired. Over the years, <laughs> Helen had admitted it's weighed on her mental health and she sees a psychiatrist and takes medication. She's bettering herself. What yeah, the heck? Fuck oh this girl. God. That's Bro. crazy. Oh OP. my god. I can't believe I can't believe this started with she's a little oh wait, no, sorry. I, 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 yeah. Well, this guy's obviously in love with Dean, no? Yeah. He's like, Dean's the whole package. Of Smart, course. beautiful, and incredible. And his but girlfriend Helen, sucks. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, OP is um, obviously in love. Yeah. Like, yeah. for sure. My so, God. It was his boss. It, yeah, boss. yeah, her boss. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I don't know. Boss, yeah. uh, uh, he sounds we know? maybe a little bit jealous. Uh, maybe a little bit. <laughs> yeah. I might be She's reading into this. developed her own irrational anxiety. She's had some jobs over the years. In the hours her dad is home with her mom from work. So I guess like she's in the spare couple hours she has between taking her care of her, mom. Her, her mom and like <laughs> her dad not being home. She works. She's, doing everything she's not unemployed. <laughs> yeah. Oh but we have screaming slash crying panic attacks while on the job. She has them at home sometimes too at night, but she can calm herself down apparently. Why? Yeah, this poor woman. She's never yeah, finished school person. or held down a job. This feels like why punching is, down. Why is it? Does OP know all this? Is Dean telling her everything? That's a great question. Dean is probably flirting. <laughs> you think Dean's <laughs> and, and maybe so maybe Dean's like, yeah, you know, she was That's she was a crazy theory. Oh, yeah. uh, here we go. Here we go. I'm putting on my tinfoil. <laughs> I've not I, think, I think Dean is telling all of this, being like, oh, like, like she's my girlfriend's so terrible. I wish there was someone better. And kind of like soft hitting on OP. 
That's huge yeah. conspiracy. I think that maybe it's uh, the girl, the OP is reading into this yeah. in a crazy way that makes no sense. But, but why would Dean tell her, like an employee, all of this, like pretty maybe private she's stuff about his yeah. girlfriend? Other conspiracy theory she um, is stalking the girlfriend <laughs> yes because she's in love with Dean yeah. so she's like yeah. can you even believe her I went through her Facebook <laughs> found out her mom's problems <laughs> and now I'm like pissed about them and I looked at her like, LinkedIn she's not very consistent phone. very <laughs> spotty resume very spotty Incredibly. she does seem like a raging maniac she does so. seem crazy well, yeah. let's get back to reality yeah. oh and see God. what actually happens so Dean and I have talked about it many times. Oh. He insists she's doing her best, that she does all the cooking, cleaning, laundry, yard work, et cetera, oh at her God. home. That's she it. gets a very <laughs> small amount of money from her father for a, her, like a weekly stipend or like, I don't know, like a uh, whatever that thing is called where you get money each week. Allowance? Allowance. Stipend. There we go. She also <gasps> does video game streaming and makes money from that. Barely any, I think. <laughs> She's an entrepreneur. She's a self-starter. Also, to make I, any money from streaming, you, you have, have to have some take level time. of notoriety. Yeah. yeah. Also, yeah. the barely any, I think. Barely <laughs> any. Barely any. You don't really know. They've been yeah. together for five years, and he's come to, to the term with the fact that she may never work or get educated. She's Dean working. has She's a marketing working. degree. Sorry, not the flex you think it is. <laughs> right, right. Dean's so high, he has a marketing degree. Yeah, can you believe? He has a, a master's in marketing from DeVry University. <laughs> yeah, I think he knows what he's talking about, all right? Very educated individual. Uh, but he doesn't seem to care. He says he will provide financially, and he's okay with her being a stay-at-home mom someday, or even just a stay-at-home wife. I DM'd him, asking <laughs> why he's even in love with her. Okay, How obsessed? That's insane. You DM'd him? DM, yeah. Yeah, if they're so well, close, why don't they have numbers? Have numbers? Yeah. yeah. How he fell in love with her and just why. I don't get it. He can do so much better. Oh, like and, me. <laughs> <laughs> and he said this. Oh, man. Here we go. Oh, wow. <laughs> you upset to read it. <laughs> This is cute. I fell in love with her for so many reasons. She's sweet, kind, and she always sees the best in people, even with everything that she's been through. I think she's funny, beautiful, intelligent, and is always trying to do some good. I like that she's random, silly, quirky, and passionate as fuck. I like how competitive she is because I'm competitive too. I like that she's athletic. I like how she cooks things top of the dome without needing to Google everything like me. I love her giggle and I really love her smile. I like her singing voice. Well, all of her voices. I like her hugs and I like uh -oh. kisses. I like when her fingers are in my hair. I like the things that she draws or makes from hand. I like when she holds my hand. I like her taste in memes and I like her taste in music. Beans? I like her puns and her sense of humor. I really like her presence and I like her dance moves and how good she is at everything. I like that she is <laughs> <laughs> He's going. I like, still not done. I like that she likes to help people. I genuinely like the person that she is and always have. I admire her a lot and will always want her for myself. Loser! <laughs> <laughs> Wow. That's pretty uneducated to me. <laughs> Damn. I, I feel like what I'm getting um, is they need to develop or create a boundary as a boss and an employee. One million percent. Yeah, yeah that's crazy. So, uh, context. They she was working under him and then they became friends outside of artwork and she is no longer, she's no longer interning working, yeah. at that place. Okay, oh. okay, that's good to know. Oh. But to DM someone and say, Why are you in like yeah. what's why even are you the in deal? Love? Why and are you in love with the Did he DM this back? Yes. He DM this back. He's wow. like, shut the <laughs> fuck up. Yeah. 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 That's like, actually that's kind great. Of yeah, though. I love that. That's a mic drop. Yeah. I told him how I felt about him. After that? After oh that. Oh my God. Okay, you're the dumb uneducated one, all right? Oh my God, you need, need a to, context clue. You need to read people. How I'm in love with him and that I wished she wasn't around. Oh my God. <laughs> so pathetic though. And it's also so like, sad. not only to do that and then to write this and be like, am I right, guys? <laughs> That's what that's what I'm saying about the like last story too. Like uh, to write this all down, oh, yeah. read it back, and be like, Yeah, yeah, yeah this is awesome. Yeah. 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 She's like, I, I might need justice. sound like a bitch, but, uh, yeah, but only I think, uh, by the end you'll get where I'm coming We're from. We're gonna be on the same page of this. <laughs> he said, All right, so so she said that I wish she wasn't around. He oh said, my God. Well, I'm lucky that she is. I don't know what I'd do without her.
I which feel is like a clap freaking back. Yeah, yeah, he needs to stop talking to the OP. I know. Why is he still like talking to her? Walker. That is a weird thing where yeah. like sometimes you see people engaging with their exes or people yeah. that are clearly into them. Mm -hmm. And there is something sinister about that. Not to put my conspiracy hat on, but it's I do it think not. it's weird for... <laughs> oh, okay. Oh. Actually, it's weird for Dean to be communicating with OP. Yeah. At all. Yeah. If you know someone is this into you and you're in a committed relationship. Yeah, you can't be like sending a long soliloquy about no. your lover. Even though it's defending your lover, it's right. weird. You don't need to prove anything to Send this person. Send that to your lover. Yeah. Exactly. True. Question. If he had ended that with... And this is why I can never talk to you again. You are blocked. Goodbye. That's good. That's yeah, fine. Yeah. 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 That's yeah. good. There. Middle finger emoji. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, he keeps going. He keeps He's going. still yeah. entertaining it. Because also yeah. if she, if the, if uh, Dean's girlfriend figured out that this was like the conversation was happening. Yeah. What the yeah. Yeah. Why, why is I that going on? I think she would be a little bit what the Yeah. yeah One million yeah. percent. Absolutely. But let's see what actually happened. Cool. So I told him. He's just comfortable and he's staying with her because it's been a long time. She's toughly down that I've been at a place in my life where I thought I couldn't go on with certain people, but I survived and he would too. He said this. Well, I don't want to. So I appreciate you not saying things like this. Uh, quote, I wish she wasn't in the picture. That's awful. If you cared at all about me, then you'd say that. I'm lucky to have her and respect that, you know? <laughs> Why not just stop talking just to her? Stop yeah. talking here. She doesn't yeah. care about you. Yeah. I think yeah. it does. Dean needs to get better yeah. at ghosting. Yeah. yeah. So he adamantly won't leave her. And I don't understand why. He told you why. <laughs> it was a very long text. <laughs> Almost too distracting. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. With the little money she earns, she saves up to do some very special things for me. She sounds great. <laughs> yeah, she sounds fantastic. Yeah, she's like, I'm going to take all the money I can possibly earn. I just want to spend it on you because I love you so much. Oh How dare she? Yeah, uh, damn. She got him a cameo from his favorite actress, took him to see his favorite sports team in the playoffs, got him a PS4. She's taking him to his favorite band. And this summer, she does all these quote unquote sweet things. Oh, but God. I know what they really are. Like, yeah, him random mean. cards, drawings, paintings, crap like that. I think maybe that's the real reason he stays with her. But I could do that stuff for him too. She's had years to do it. Oh, oh God. My God. Well, this person needs to be hit by a truck. <laughs> yes, I think. Literally. <laughs> She uh, continues. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm studying hard. I work at a barista to get through school. I love talking to him. I love spending time with him. <gasps> he means the world to me. Does anyone have advice on how I can win him over? I just want him for myself. I'm the better choice for him. He just doesn't realize it right now. What can I do here? Get a restraining order. <laughs> yeah. Okay, Voldemort. Like, <laughs> yeah, damn. And oh, oh I, this, I, I feel like we don't get this very often. We have screenshots of texts. Oh my god. Between them. Oh. <gasps> and some relevant comments and an update. Oh my god. Whoa. Wow. So we got we got we got some we got some juice still to squeeze, but where uh, <laughs> you don't squeeze juice. I just want to clarify. <laughs> <laughs> So uh, where where do you think she's at, like mentally, emotionally with this person? Because it feels like I'm going to like little stalker vibes. Definitely stalker yeah. vibes. If yeah. I'm Dean also, I'm like, if I see this person around, I'm being like, hey, and then sort of yeah. dodging around the other grocery <laughs> yeah. aisle. I yeah. don't want to communicate with this person at all. No. I think I'm running. Yeah, I'm yeah. running. Like, yeah. She's also, if you want to win this person over being like, your fucking girlfriend sucks <laughs> and she's a loser. Like he obviously didn't care for that. No. He's rejecting against that. So there's kind of no hope for her. Yeah, I hope. <laughs> I, I, but I'm still like wondering why he responds at all. Like yeah. I wonder if like he feels like he has to respond to make her not like feel I don't know more obsessed in a way. I'm just wondering if they're in like some sort of thing where they have to see each other every day. Maybe well, they're not still working together. She doesn't work. She you know, but I don't know. Cause like, why else would he? Maybe she's know. a barista. Maybe there's, she's around. That's where he goes yeah. to the coffee. Yeah. 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 He's like, really my awkward. favorite coffee shop. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh. Yeah. Sounds like a friend's episode. So yeah. <laughs> we do have <gasps> screenshots. Exciting. Um, and, okay. So we have screenshots. Is this the first? Okay. Okay, yeah. Wow. <laughs> um, okay. So it starts, how materialistic are you? You're, uh, uh, so he, uh, wait, so that's, he says, yeah, how, he materialistic says, how materialistic are you? are you? She says, you're really going to support some stupid for the rest of your life? 
That's really insane. He says, it's none of your business. Why do you apologize if you're still going to be like this? And she responds, because I don't think you realize how dumb what you're choosing yourself is. She's not worth it. You can have someone who is your equal, which I guess she means herself. <laughs> and the guy with me. <laughs> Listen, I don't have to argue with you about who I'm going to marry, Lowell. You want to <gasps> talk? We can talk about anything you want except my relationship. Uh, Otherwise, I won't be replying. Why, why are you continuing to reply? That's weird. <laughs> he responds, you looked out for me, so I'm looking out for you. I'm just being a good friend. Oh, she has no that. job, though, and I do. I mean, like... Hey, a barista is a job. As a as a former barista, um, no. <laughs> yeah, just used to be a barista, and it's sort of yeah, it's a job, but it's sort of hell also. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're oh a real God. treat. At least I'm not a broke. Bitch. You work in a coffee shop and rent a room. <laughs> yeah, which is more than she does, isn't it? No, actually, call my girlfriend a bitch one more time. You're gonna I kill call her. them like I see them. Uh, no one else would do that. So this is from her still. You're still talking to me. You didn't give up. And then Dean says, just trying to look out. Doesn't seem like you have anyone else. Anyone would do the same. Oh, he's like, the only reason I'm talking to you is because you don't have any friends. Oh, and I'm worried about you. So oh. Dean is responding because like, like he's like, this girl's You're clearly mental health out of your mind. Unstable. Yes, that oh. makes sense. Oh, Dean's Doink. just a really, really nice guy. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Wow. Yeah, he's just in angel <laughs> yeah, oh like, my god opie's an outcast yeah. <laughs> like a banished yeah. member of society and dean's taking pity I'm anyone just, would do the same and then she responds not any guy i've met before i just wish she wasn't in the picture i guess well i'm lucky she is i don't know what i'd do without her so this is what we were talking about in the right. uh, uh the actual yeah. post and then she responds you'd go on like everyone else does there are many people i thought i couldn't go on without but here i am you could figure it out too and then uh we have the text that he sent back that we heard about in the post mm. well i don't want to so i appreciate you not saying things like i wish she was in the picture that's awful if you cared at all about me then you'd say i'm lucky to have her and respect that you know so there are some uh. relevant comments <gasps> and riley hide those so they can't look so um do you think those texts absolve her in any way no, no. <laughs> they make it seem so much worse. Although they do put into context that Indeed. she's like the town yeah. nut. Yeah, <laughs> she's like the barista that's like, ah, I know what's best for you, like running around like a crazy person. Yeah. She's really giving like Azula vibes yeah. in the beach. Do you remember the beach episode where she's like, yeah. you're so sharp, you could puncture the whole of the enemy. <laughs> yeah, she's like, together, you, me as a barista, and you as a marketing <laughs> professional, we can rule the world. We can rule yeah. the world together. Yeah. Oh, uh, again, like. Why show the text to the internet? Like, do you not realize well, how terrible it okay, you? So, so if I'm putting myself in OP shoes, if she really truly believes she's in the right, yeah. this is all evidence proving yeah. her point further. So she's like, I'm so in the right. I'll, I'll lay it all on the field. Yeah. So she has nothing to hide. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Nothing to hide. The relevant comments are fucking crazy too. <laughs> <laughs> Wood Ford Reverse says, can't you just be friends with benefits? What? Makes no sense. This person's fucking brain dead. Didn't read <laughs> yeah. any of this. Let's, let's encourage him to cheat on his wife who's like yeah. taking care of his parents. I and... think I think he read. they read the title and they were like, well, oh, there's an easy solution. Can <laughs> yeah. you guys just hook up and be friends? Opie says he doesn't want that. I asked <laughs> and sent nudes. <laughs> He asked me to stop immediately or he would cut contact. Unsolicited. Oh. Unsolicited dudes. And this then little Mid-Game responds, you asked for news from a guy in a happy relationship <laughs> and sent him some, even though he has a girlfriend. Oh my God. This is the easiest. You're the asshole we've had in the last week. <laughs> And then we do have some more relevant comments. We have a back and forth between two people. So <laughs> Shmoved says, there's clearly something he sees in her that he doesn't see in you. You can't <laughs> explain why people like who they like. If he's happy with her and the relationship, then that's that. Your attempts to drive them apart will only drive your friend away from you. Which is, I feel like, really down to earth uh, uh, advice for someone who's not down to earth at all. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. Hope he responds. He hasn't let himself see me in that light though. <laughs> if he did, oh. he would see, I can offer to him all she does and more. He just thinks he's happy. Love is blind. He has no idea what he's in right now because he's in so deep. He thinks he's happy because he's smiling all the time and saying <laughs> how much he loves his girlfriend. <laughs> if he could just wake up and realize we would be a very happy life in the future. Shmovid responds. What do you think about any of this? Does 
doesn't matter. If it's what he thinks, move on. <laughs> Opie responds, why can't I change the way he thinks? I'm seeing it as an intervention for his dead end relationship. I just don't think anyone here is hearing me out. It seems <laughs> bad on the surface, but it isn't. She's like, all oh, these people on the internet are wrong yeah. too. I'm being they bullied. Just don't yeah. No one gets me. <laughs> I guess she was counting on like the idea of being like, look, like I'm just a girl from a small town. Yeah. Like, yeah. The I'm internet, the underdog. The global community of the internet will have my back. I'm just a barista looking for love. Yeah. Yeah. Right. yeah. 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 It's yeah. Like she's Taylor Swift in the background. Oh. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. There are some like we have like a bunch more relevant comments where we're getting more information about them. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to read some more. Please. I, they get a little crazier. <laughs> uh, crazy says, lol, OK, so I should let him be homeless with her and live as rest of his life. He could have everything with me and more. I'm going to have a steady career. I'll have a degree. I'll have many things. So I dream of things he and I can achieve together, which is totally Azula. Yes. Totally giving Azula. We can have everything if she ceased to exist. God, is I just wish she did her? That's all. If that makes me bitter, then okay. She's a barista. <laughs> no. We can have everything. Lattes, <laughs> cappuccinos, muffins. <laughs> <laughs> Not the muffins. <laughs> Alexander Frost Fry responds, homeless? <laughs> I think most people wouldn't care if they were living on the streets with their loved one. Okay, that's a little far. Yeah, yeah it would be hard, but they wouldn't be alone. I mean, I guess it's better than being alone and homeless. I, yeah. <laughs> they love the, <laughs> on the I'm street. confused about this response. And that's a big conclusion to jump to. I think he'd be able to support both him, himself, and his girlfriend. Also, the DM screenshots, which I finally read, just made you seem even worse. <laughs> it's one thing to call her a bitch to strangers on the internet, but to do it to her boyfriend, damn. I can't believe he's still even bothering to talk to you. I think you belong in r slash nice girls. I hope you figure yourself and your behavior out. It's not okay to treat anyone like this. Mm -hmm. And then we got another, we got one more relevant comment before the update. Too many ants says link him in this Reddit post and he'll be able to see where you're coming from oh my God. in a way that's clearer than text messages, oh. which are short and impersonal. They're trapping her. Yeah, they are. <laughs> They're like, link, link him. Yeah. Yeah. He'll totally see he'll reason now. Yeah. yeah, exactly. Yeah. He'll see it with super clear eyes and he'll probably even realize he needs to take the problem person out <gasps> of his life. They're trapping that's so funny. <laughs> wow. Your replies in particular will show him everything he hasn't realized. Oh my God. <laughs> That's awesome. <gasps> oh my God. OP does not see the trap. <laughs> So you agree she's the problem. <laughs> Thank you. People in the post are judging me so hard and I'm trying to stand by myself because I know what I believe in here is right for me <gasps> and him. I'm giving him some time to cool off, but I'll link it to him this weekend. Oh my God. Too many ants is a mastermind. Too many ants. Might want to do it sooner than later. There's a decent <laughs> chance the thread won't be around by the weekend. I'd be surprised if it made it to the end of today. OP, what do you mean? I don't think it'll be deleted. I'll send it to him now then and just tell him to open his eyes and have an open heart. Maybe he'll come around. Thanks for being understanding, unlike anyone else. And uh, <laughs> after OP was talked into sending the post to Dean, Dean responds. <gasps> And I will read you the yes. screenshot. Wow. This is so fucking oh juicy. My God. Now, L, you linked me to this post <laughs> so I could understand you better. And now I do. <gasps> I love my girlfriend more than life itself. I've been with her for five years for a reason, not because of what she can offer me financially, but because of who she is as a person. That's what matters to me. I'll work three jobs if it means keeping her. For example, she once spent two hours traveling in the rain to bring my sick mom some homemade soup. Money doesn't buy that kind of heart. I never told you that story because you would get emotional and angry with me for even bringing up my girlfriend. I tried to be your friend because you seemed lonely. When we worked together, you said your roommates don't talk to you and your family is back in your home country. We never had a future together. It's not even a possibility. I will protect that woman at all costs and it really hurts me to see you talking about her to strangers on the internet. I hope you'll have the integrity to take this down. 
No. <laughs> no. Here we are. Here we are. <laughs> Maybe it's best we don't stay friends for now and see where things head. You sent me this link though to this thread and then you immediately blocked me on Instagram. Why? I don't understand what you want from me at this point, but it's no longer worth my energy. If you're ready to grow up and respect my relationship, give me a call. Ding, ding. Okay, that no. is weird. By the way, if I got something like this, I'm in a relationship. I'm just immediately being like, thanks so much. Uh, we are not speaking anymore. Yeah. Block immediately. Yeah. Right? Yeah. A thousand she's, percent. She's like at the level of I'm worried like for this man's safety and the girlfriend's yes. safety. She's literally saying, I wish she wasn't in I the wish picture. she yes. ceased to exist. Yeah. Ceased to exist. <laughs> she's <laughs> going to fucking arson. <laughs> oh, yeah. Literally. Uh, that is also what Azula says too. Yeah. yeah. I think that, that honestly, um, like obviously OP is crazy, but I think Dean, that was not a good call for him to add at the end. Give me a call. Totally because weird. he will take that and run. It opens the door. She's, a, she's just yeah. like, I just have to wait for him to cool yeah. off. Right. Yeah. What are you possibly going to have to talk about yeah. on a call? Yeah. <laughs> Oh my god! Her plans of of, of conquering the world yeah. from barista to CEO. Yeah, like, yeah. You know yeah. what? Oh my god. I'm gonna go out of love. I think Dean's an asshole. <laughs> Whoa, oh, yeah. Dean! Yeah, Dean. I think Dean is dumb. Uh, yeah, yeah. Dean I don't think Dean's an. <laughs> So yeah. I think Dean's <laughs> yeah, okay. really dumb. He's either st like he's either stupid, like he's either so impossibly stupid. I think so. Yeah. Or he's a soul for even like like leading this girl on in any way. No, I think by even talking to her. Like I he just needs to stop talking to her. It's so obvious. I think this post is about uh, extremes. Yes. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> extreme craziness and yeah. extreme dumbness. Because Dean, I think, is also doing the thing of being like, there's that of good in everyone. Like, yeah. just give me a call. We can be friends. Yeah. Like, everything's yeah. fine. And this person is a psycho. Yeah. You know what? Actually, that maybe changed my mind. I think yeah. Dean's just an angel. Yeah. 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 He's just a sweetie with no. an idiot brain. <laughs> yeah. Like, Dude, I've, I had a friend idiot. who was like, I've never hated anyone in my entire life. And I feel like that's this vibe, which is insane to me. Whoa. Like, Who have you hated? Well, I, I don't know. Hey, I don't names. have specifics. <laughs> Rebecca, <laughs> Rebecca uh, you stole my pencil. Oh. I never forgave you. Oh, uh, no. But just like, even he was like, I never disliked anyone. Like, okay. what? Okay, he sounds dumb. like milk <laughs> Yeah. yeah yes. It was like boring. I mean, yeah, <laughs> you never disliked anyone that yeah. no, you're probably pretty boring. No, you it's weird. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. You haven't loved. Yeah, yeah. You haven't been enemies. talking to enough people. Yeah. 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 No, and the what point of that was that that this is Dean. Yeah, this is Dean. Oftentimes well, I give the advice on my show where it's like people call and be like, I'm in love with this person, but they're in a relationship, whatever. The best thing you could possibly do is just be a good person yeah. around that person. Yeah. But like you can't create a calculated plan for that relationship to fall apart. Just yeah. if it does, then you'll be there being a good person and a good friend yeah. actually. And maybe that works out your way. Yeah. So true. Agreed. But you know what? I want to see if the person is a good person in this next story. I, 19 female, am being excluded from our gaming group. I decided to find a new group. Boyfriend, 20 male, is the one upset. Mm. Hmm. Hmm. I would never be excluded from a gaming group. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us more. I'm too cool. Cool. Yes. Um, I am also too, gaming. I am too <laughs> powerful. <laughs> they would never leave my house. That's <laughs> embarrassing. No. I'm a barista. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so G Mage Emma. Right. Gemma Gemma. Yep, keep going. <laughs> 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 says, I am in a gaming group that has about 10 members, 18 to 25, uh, female slash male, including my boyfriend and I. A month ago, I had a fallout with a member in the group who I'll, ca uh, who I'll call Roger, 25 male. Basically, I don't like Roger. All he ever does is degrade and talk about how women are backstabbing bees who you can never trust. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, I thought uh, I was thinking like... Like, like actual bees. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Humble bees. <laughs> that was I was backstabbing bees. Always it, you yes. yes. Sorry, they're backstabbing bitches. With their damn <laughs> pollen. <laughs> you can never trust. Don't save him. And how much he loves to smoke 
didn't do drugs. And those are connecting statements. What That's a guy. awesome. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like my best friend. Yeah. That's it. Uh, concerning. <laughs> <laughs> Hearing those things constantly became a drag. So I decided that I didn't want to be around him anymore. Ever since I cut off contact, I've been excluded from games where Roger plays because he doesn't want me there. Even my boyfriend told me not to join because it'll piss off Roger. Obviously, I don't want to play with Roger either. So this is fine with me. The thing is, when Roger's playing, I'm excluded from the group as I can't play with anyone else because they're all playing with Roger. This happens three to four days every week and they play for five to six hours a day. This oh is intense. Jesus. How old are they? 18 to 25? 18 to 20, like, or, yeah. Cool. What this is a playing? job. Probably yeah. D&D. Yeah. D &D. Probably it sounds like D&D, &D, but I'm like, sometimes Roger's not there. Yeah. But eight, like hours and hours Three a day? Three to four days a week is a lot to play D&D. &D. That's Five so to much. six hours is not a, like that is a regular time. Yeah. A regular time to yeah. play one game of D&D? &D? Yeah, it's yeah. like a session takes yeah. a long time. Yeah, they're long sessions. They're long like sessions. four is like a short amount really? of hours. Yeah, yeah. yeah. People but play three to four time. days is a lot. That's a ton. Yeah. Wow. Do you play D&D? I do. I played a bunch of games. Me too. Me too. It's good. Yeah. Huge shout out. <laughs> Sophie is trying to do a and d game yeah, on the pod. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 I'm excited. Really fun. Uh -huh. But back to this story. <laughs> I'm really shy, so I don't talk much in the group games besides doing the usual call outs. I know everyone would much rather play with Roger than me since he's more outgoing and fun to them, so I don't interfere. Oh. Even so, I still feel like for being left out constantly. My boyfriend didn't even defend me the first time I was excluded. Oh, oh he's horrible. He just told me to not join ever again and uh, left it at that. Sir. <laughs> sir. What? <gasps> Only one other person in the group has defended me, and that's my best friend, 19 male, since middle school. When I first told him about the situation, he got really angry and asked me if I wanted him to stop playing with Roger too. I know my boyfriend and best friend love playing with Roger though, so I didn't ask them to stop. Last night, Roger and the group were all playing again. I decided to look for some other group uh, groups online to play with because being alone sucks. Well, on a break. <laughs> so she's on her laptop, like off to the side. Yeah. And it's like 10 people just laugh and have a jolly old time. She's like, <laughs> she's like, I need another. This is so bad. This is so sad. Are they playing online? Mm. They're playing in person, um, I think, right? No, I think they're playing in person, but she's looking for groups online to I play see. with. Yeah. <laughs> While on a break from his game, my boyfriend asked what I was doing. I told him casually that I was looking for a new gaming group to play with. His reaction was not what I was expecting. He got upset and kept questioning me why I wanted to leave our old gaming group. But he already told her to leave. He said, don't come back at me. <laughs> yeah. Why would you leave? I only told you to leave. I told you to leave. I told him since I'm being excluded from our old group so often, I may as well find a new group to play with because I obviously don't fit in anymore. Even after my answers, he would keep asking me why I couldn't just stay and participate in the group often. How am I supposed to participate in a group when I'm being excluded from it weekly? At that point, I told my boyfriend to stop talking to me about the subject and to leave it. He then said to me that I was overreacting to being excluded from the group and then <laughs> went on a rant about why I couldn't just just be happy for once since he still plays with me daily. My boyfriend and I do play daily, but we play alone with just us two since no one else in the group can play at the times we're online. <laughs> Oh, so it's, it, gotta be it's video an online. Games. Yeah. 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 It's gotta be like they're playing Fortnite uh, or something. Yeah. 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 Um, being excluded from playing with everyone else is what makes me feel like shit, not being excluded from playing with my boyfriend. I told him that if I find a new group, I would always play with him first, no matter what. However, I just want to find a new group to play with when he and everyone else are playing with Roger, since I can't join in the first place and playing alone mm. sucks. He said, fine, in an annoyed tone, and we <laughs> left it at that. We haven't spoken about it since, but I can tell he's upset over it. Am I really overreacting to the situation? Do I just ignore my boyfriend for now? Do I say oh. something? This is the first time I've ever seen him so upset over something I did. I'm not sure what to do. And there is an update. <gasps> over something she did. She didn't do anything. What did she do? Like yeah. Find was, someone who wants to play with you yeah. as much as you want to play with them. She was yeah. excluded. Also, they shouldn't hang out with Roger. Yeah. Sorry, but you can't hang out with someone who's like an asshole. He seems blatantly misogynistic. Yeah, yeah. you can't hang out with that guy. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, was Roger the one that everyone likes? Or yes. Is that wait, 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 wait. We love Roger. Oh, wait, He's wait, so wait. shitting on women. Yeah, dude, he's so <laughs> hilarious, bro. <laughs> he does <laughs> I wonder, okay, so she said that the group ranged from 18 to 25. I wonder yeah. if it's a bunch of like 18, 19 year old dudes that are yeah. like, yo, Roger's like 25 and he's really freaking living life. Uh -huh. yeah. He's hanging out with 
of those he's 18 so year cool. olds. He's out here freaking hitting dabs and just like insulting yeah. women. Like, what, yeah. what a guy. Well, uh, OP is 19 and then the boyfriend is 20. So they are a couple of years younger than I mean, Roger. And Roger's 25. Yeah. And Roger knows everything about the world. He's the leader, <laughs> he's the leader of the pack. Yeah. yeah Listen, yeah. guys, I've been around the block. <laughs> yeah. yeah I you smoked can't, a lot of weed. <laughs> so much weed. You can't hang out with that guy. No. Yeah. Yeah. No. Yeah. No. But it's, I mean, it's a red flag that the boyfriend is just going along with all yeah, of this. Yeah, also break up with the boyfriend. Yeah, yeah. break 100%. up with that dude. Break up with the boyfriend. Yeah, take him out. Take him out. Take him out. Yeah. Wait um, a minute. <laughs> yeah, but also, wait. like, I don't know why the boyfriend's mad. Like, if she actually yeah. is wanting to stay with the boyfriend, yeah. then I would not advise her to do that. But <laughs> it sounds like the, the boyfriend, I don't know why he would be mad that she's trying to game with other people. Yeah, he told her that she can't play with them. Because and he's then, controlling. Yeah. Dang right. <laughs> there we have it. There we have it, baby. Uh, yeah. <laughs> But there is an update. Oh, let's get it. Thank you, everyone, for all the advice. And thank you to those that also offered to play with me. I wasn't expecting my post Aww. to get so many replies. Oh, that's very cute. Oh, yes. <laughs> that's, that's so sweet. <laughs> uh, unfortunately, I had some unrelated family business, so I couldn't respond to you all. However, I have read everything and have taken all your words into consideration. Some people have also asked me questions about how we can play so often, as we asked. Yeah. Uh, how long I've been with my boyfriend, etc. So I'll just give a brief background. Skip to the next line if you don't want to read it. We do. <laughs> <laughs> we do. First off, most of us are college students, 18 to 20, either working part time or staying at home with our parents. As of right now, most of us are on summer break. We only have two older members in the group, which are Roger, 25 male. <laughs> I and called it! <laughs> Hell yeah. And another guy, 23 male. The rest of us are or fall under 20. Roger's actually married and his wife makes good banks, so he has tons of free time. <laughs> You hate Roger Ooh, so much, dude. He's the worst. What? He's a freeloader. So Roger's just sitting out here gaming with a bunch of 18-year-olds. Yeah. Mary, yeah. cash yeah. in hand. Yeah, saying that he hates all women as his like wife is paying Big for bills. everything. Dude. Yeah, wait, uh, what did he say? I totally missed that. Uh, hold on, hold on. Wait, he says, um, backstabbing bitches who you can never trust. He said women are backstabbing bitches you yeah. can never trust? Yeah, the two things we know like about Roger wife. is yeah. that he thinks all women are backstabbing bitches who you can never trust and he loves to smoke weed and do drugs and he's married and his oh, wife yeah. makes all the cash <laughs> the things that we know about roger yeah uh and he's 25 sorry there's four things yeah. Um, he, yeah. no, he's like he's like women are so dumb they'll marry a 25 year old pothead <laughs> yeah. who hates women what idiots <laughs> oh my uh, goodness and then op continues second about my boyfriend surprisingly we met through the gaming group as he was the one who advertised it which was how i found and joined the group that was about two years ago and about a couple of months after we met we just clicked and started dating oh after a couple of months they started dating mm. My boyfriend has known Roger for about three years, so they're close friends. However, Roger did not join the group until six months ago, as mm. my boyfriend invited him because he thought it'd be fun to have him there too. I didn't know much of Roger other than that he was my boyfriend's friend until he joined the group. Uh, so after I posted my original posts, I signed up for two different groups. The first one was an all women's group, 16 to 20 uh, female. They responded to me pretty quickly. They were very nice and polite, but explained that they only play once to twice a week. Unfortunately, that didn't cut it for me. <laughs> what game are they I playing? Did. Yeah, God. they're obsessed with this game. Jeez. I understand it's summer break, but you know. Doesn't hit my quota. Touch grass. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah damn. literally. Go for a walk. Yeah. Um, unfortunately, yeah. So the second group responded to me the next day and I learned that they were more active, but they're also an all men's group, 17 to 19 male. Mm. However, they were open to having me there. At first I felt pretty sketched, but the oldest and most popular guy. Ooh. <laughs> I don't like these weird faction groups. Uh, yeah. The most popular guy the at the gaming group of yeah. 17 so to 19 cool. year old. Uh, he's 19. He's held back yeah. still in high school. Yeah. But he's on the varsity football team. Hell yeah. Um, 19 male there took me aside and explained to me that he doesn't tolerate any type of harassment and that he will definitely kick out any of the other guys if they were bothering me. Yeah. He, he sounds so cool. Dude. <laughs> he sounds cool at first, but then I'm like, maybe this guy's like, like, like as long as you just be my girlfriend, uh, yeah. then I'm not going to let anything <laughs> yeah. happen to you. I will protect you, babe. That's yeah. what a man does. <laughs> Um, <laughs> that's the only way I respect a woman. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Hearing that made me feel more comfortable and I played some games with them. I had so much fun. All the guys were really nice and friendly. No sexual remarks. No more screaming nice. of profanity against women, <laughs> etc. 
It was nice being in a group of people who were happy to play with me. Oh. This is sad. Uh, after I finished my games and left, my boyfriend called me and asked if we could talk. When he came over before I could even ask or speak myself, he told me he was really sorry and that he screwed up big time. And he understands how wrong he was. He said he didn't want me to go to a new group because he feared that I would leave him too for some new guy. Then he told me <laughs> that he didn't realize how hurt I was from being excluded from the group because I never complained or voiced against it, which was true. I never complained about the exclusions or even Roger's behavior before because I knew it would just cause more conflict. I also didn't want my boyfriend to stop playing with his friends because of me. I explained this to him and he said he was sorry for not defending and comforting me like he should have been in the first place. Didn't she, she went and was like, yeah, I'm finding yeah. other groups because you don't want me to so say you're excluding. Yeah. Me. yeah and he was right? like, I didn't realize that meant that you were hurt that we were excluding you. <laughs> yeah. Damn. Um, you cannot read between the lines. A man really can't. Also, she shouldn't have to say, she shouldn't have to tell him that Roger uh, like attacking all women, women. is uh, yeah, 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 right. of course. Like, yeah. like I didn't realize that that, that was misogyny would yeah. be hurtful. Yeah. 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 Also, him being like, I didn't thought you were gonna date another guy from your other gaming group. Like, yeah. This is I, the only yeah. coming back to you. Yeah. 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 That's, That's the only reason I'm apologizing. Is this the guy from the first story? <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. He's come back. Yeah. <laughs> this is his, his new girlfriend. Yeah. yeah exactly. <laughs> it's been three, three weeks this time. Yeah. <laughs> to my surprise, he then showed me his text messages between him and Roger that happened a few months ago. Apparently way before my exclusion, Roger had a few conversations with my boyfriend, telling him how much of a pain it was to play with me there. He wanted my boyfriend to <sighs> kick me out. However, my boyfriend refused and told Roger what? that was not happening. You can't but be friends with fucking Roger. Dude. That's crazy. And he still brought him in and is like, yeah. I love Roger. Wait, how, wait, how long ago was this? Uh, months before oh months a few before? months ago roger messaged him about this asking, okay is this yeah. like are we like way in the future now like like yes how, like like when when did these events first start ha like happening? what do you mean the the texts between roger and no so the texts were a couple months ago when did like she get like ostracized she, from the group or is this all the same she just recently got ostracized but she started oh, playing months i think ago, months ago yeah. yeah so i think right from the get-go why roger choosing was like roger over his girlfriend Roger's so funny. Roger, he's 25. He's so cool. <laughs> then around the time when I decided to stop hanging out around Roger, that's when Roger sent a group text to everyone in the group explaining how he doesn't want me to play with the group again. Oh. And he hopes everyone understands. That's crazy. Everyone, and to my shock, even my best friend <gasps> all agreed with him. Why? Only what? my boyfriend protested. But Roger was really stubborn and he had the whole group to support him. So my boyfriend gave up. After showing me these texts, he told me next that he kicked Roger from their group earlier today. Finally. It's too late. <sighs> You're way too, late. Way too late. late. Everyone's rallying against you. He's like, yeah. okay, I go back in the group and everyone hates me now. Like, yeah. what the fuck? Yeah. Roger was not allowed to play with them anymore, but my boyfriend said he'd still be willing to play with Roger one on one, but only like once a month. <laughs> Surprisingly, Roger agreed, and that was that. My boyfriend said he understood if I didn't want to be with him anymore, but said that he truly does love me. Honestly, even after all that has happened, I'm not mad at my boyfriend. Oh, but you should be. You really should, you should be. be. You should he accept more it. from yeah. your relationship. Uh, this is both of our first relationship, and we're still learning. He's always been kind to me, and I've never had a problem with him before this situation occurred. But also, the relationship lasted it's only been a couple months. Yeah. And the, the problem occurred for a couple yeah. months ago. Yeah. Yeah. So there's been problems the entire <laughs> relationship. Yeah. Time. Yeah. Um, uh, uh, I've lost my place. Oh, I feel happy that he realized his mistakes and did apologize without me asking. This is the first time he's ever come across a situation where he has no choice but to choose a side. So I don't blame him for trying to do anything to keep the group together. Except for the time where Roger said, I'm not going to play with your girlfriend, so kick her out of the group. <laughs> Uh, he told me he would also like me to come back to our old group, but he said it's completely fine if I stay with my new group. He knows it was wrong of him to ask me not to join a new group. I told him I don't think I'll ever come back to the old group and that I will definitely be sticking with my new group from now on. However, I will always make time for him and put him first. He accepted it without any protests and we went back to our usual fun activities. Ugh. 
Uh, I feel bad that my boyfriend may have lost a close friend since I never asked him to do any of that for me. Regardless, I'm happy. And lately, my boyfriend and I have been spending more time together now that R, he's not even Roger anymore. He's just R, (laughs) isn't around as much. I have also continued playing with my new group and it's been awesome. If you made it this far, thanks for reading this long update. Thank you guys once again. I don't really like how it ended. No, no there, are, sorry, there are some relevant comments. Okay. Ooh, okay. Um, I hope yeah. they're like a little like, boyfriend's I broke up with a red boyfriend. flag. Yeah. yeah. Boyfriend sucks. He is. <gasps> Roger sucks. Boyfriend sucks. Best friend sucks. Best friend. Best friend being like, yeah, f- her. we well, shouldn't yeah. play with her. Like, what, what if two faced pieces? Yeah, shit. exactly. Is that real? That's not, probably not your best friend then. No. 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 Since they were kids. Yeah. But she's yeah. like, no, but he's always there. Yeah. She said it was like my best friend since we were young. Dude. Which is crazy. Yeah. I think OP is like in like, this puppy love phase of just like, oh no, it's okay. Like I think OP has a very out. low bar for what friendship and love looks like. Yeah. yeah. And she's getting. young. It's her first yeah. relationship, right? Yeah. So she's yeah. like, oh, this is normal. Like we're learning, but no. This and is you're learning what sucks. Not to do. Roger's yeah. like a super villain to me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't know how I could be in the same room as Roger. Yeah. <laughs> so it's like crazy to me that everyone's defending this weird guy. Well, he yeah. seems like he's like that type of personality where he's like, everyone listens to me and follows yeah. me. Yeah. Like he has this he's like high the bully of, yeah. of the group, but and also these little like gamer boys are just like our hero. Yeah. I want to know what game they're playing so bad. So, yeah. 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 They always do this to us. They always yeah. like leave out a crucial detail like that. Yeah. yeah. Well, I feel like it's got to be some game um, where it's like high energy, like combat stuff. Yeah. They're, yeah. Yeah. There's a lot of shouting and I don't feel like Minecraft would do that. But 10 people in the group. Yeah. Right. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm like who the f- yeah, kind of team game. Yeah, I don't know. But there are some relevant comments. Uh, cool. uh, the Batman to my Bruce says, I don't like Roger. All he ever does <laughs> is degrade and talk about how women who are backstabbing is who you can never trust. It's sad, but some people are just like that. Quote, Roger's actually married and his wife makes good banks, so he has a ton of free time. And then this person says, wait, what? Does she stab him in the back with money? <laughs> That's yeah. what we were wondering. <laughs> what, what is that? Mean? What? Stab her in the back with money. Like he's like, because he's a backstab. He's yeah, like, women are all backstabbers. Yeah. So yeah. She makes all the money. Okay, he's I, making yeah. fun of him. Oh, uh, yeah, it's funny. Hilarious. That's actually really good. Um, Yudachi says, yeah, I thought that was kind of weird too. He talked about women all the time, but he's married. Bride of Chucky doll says I'm stuck on that as well. Sounds like Roger has an inferiority complex and I'm betting he'll soon also have a divorce to go with it. Yeah. Ooh, nice. Yeah. Drag Roger. Yeah. Please. Um, Daviana Morgan says, OP, I hope you're reconsidering your relationship with your best friend who had you kicked from the group. OP says, I'm definitely reconsidering it. I did confront him about the group text that occurred a month ago and he confirmed it was true that he agreed with Roger. So he's doubling down. Uh, yeah. What yeah. The- yeah, what did you out? Like, what did he, what did he, he said, a yeah, why? he said he didn't want to tell me because he knew it hurt my feelings. Shocking. Uh, Gee. Uh, <laughs> I know he did offer to leave the group before, but I'm still feeling off on how he didn't even defend me in the first place. Yeah. Um, Crichton Coro says that's pretty snake in the grass there. Very two faced. Pernice says probably hoping she would leave the group and break up with boyfriend. Then he could swoop in with her. None the wiser. He was part of the reason she got pushed out. OP says, I certainly hope not, but now I'm not sure. For starters, my best friend is gay. Despite oh, oh. Roger's the attitude, he's a charmer and caught my best friend's attention for sure. That's what she's implying. Like, what she's implying. Like, her best friend had a crush on Roger. And that's what she's implying. What she's implying. Like, her best friend had a crush on Roger. So he was like, yeah, anyway, yeah. my friend sucks. She's out of the group. <laughs> At first, crazy. I thought he agreed with Roger because he had a crush on him. But a week before my original post, my best friend admitted to me that while he was attracted to guys, he said he finds me different from most girls and would love to have a relationship <laughs> if I wasn't with my so boyfriend. Was. What? I really hope that's not the case, though. What do you mean? It is the case. He just yeah. said it. He that's literally he just it. told you. He wanted you out of the gaming group and yeah. then also to date you? That's crazy. Oh, it was like, oh my God. that was like wiggling around. I was like, oh, maybe it's here. Maybe it's yeah. here. Oh my <laughs> yes. God. Whoa. Where is this going? It's what the commenter said, right? Where he was like, he was trying to like get her out of the yeah. group quickly, hoping that she wouldn't get wise to the fact that he yeah. is part of the coup to yeah. get her out yeah. and then swoop it and be like, yeah. oh my God, I'm so sorry. Those assholes just kicked you out of the yeah. group. Right. Let me be your shoulder yeah. to cry oh on, babe. And then OP was like, no, no, that couldn't possibly be it because he's gay. But then again, he did tell me. He <laughs> <Yeah. literally laughs> that he loves yeah. me yeah. specifically. Yeah. <laughs> he's gay and also he likes me. Yeah. That's, yeah. 
Sam. Wow. You need to do friends, OP. Yeah. You need to do I friends. mean, they have a new gaming. They have that new gaming group. Yeah. yeah. I guess stick with them. Yeah. My advice for this person is just like, have friends that are just normal. Yeah. <laughs> like, I feel like everyone yeah. is playing a weird four-dimensional <laughs> chess game <laughs> with each other in the game they're playing. Yeah. It's so fucking weird. Just it's be normal. Weird. Yeah. Actually. That's fair advice. That's yeah. great advice. Wow. <laughs> Um, yeah, just leave everyone. I think that's leave the advice everyone. for today. Yeah. yeah. Be, be normal. normal. Just be normal. Just actually yeah. be normal. Yeah. Take a deep breath. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Breathe in, God. breathe out. Um, Go on a walk for 30 years. Miles, uh, yes. we we had all unperfect people today. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Absolutely. If you could share with the people where they could learn to become a perfect person. Absolutely. Well, uh, you can listen to my podcast, Perfect Person. It's everywhere podcasts are listened to, as well as YouTube, where I take uh, live callers on the show every week, and they call me with their problems, and I solve them expertly mm -hmm. with the help of special guests on the show. There we go. Guys, if you call into your show, uh, let them know that you came from here. Yeah, absolutely. Please do. But if you love us, make sure to subscribe. We love you. And, and see you tomorrow. Oh, we totally should have prepped you for that. <laughs> 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 you did great. <laughs> <laughs>